back to Blues Cup action here in the Primary Schools Girls Division. We've got Cleveland in your maroon running away from our screen and St. Bernardine's running uh, in the black and yellow running towards our screen. So you'll see there's no half times in this game, so you'll see a right of reply. So they'll, Cleveland will get the tap to start, regardless if a try is scored or isn't scored. Uh, St. Bernardine's will get a right of reply from halfway. As they get us underway here. Straight away we see St. Bernardine's with their shoot defence and Cleveland going nice and straight through their rucking, which is really good to see. Still joined in commentary by Jazzy, uh, touch coordinator at Runcorn School here. Very interesting game here, Cleveland and um, St. Bernardine's play two different styles of touch. You'll see uh, Cleveland play a nice direct form of touch, a couple of buddies and then try to get around the opposition. St. Bernadine's like to pass the ball around a bit, so this will be an interesting game to watch. Yeah, it's one of the ones that if you're tuning in and you've seen a couple of the live stream games already, uh, a couple of the teams that have done really well have been the teams that can pass around you rather than trying to run around you. So I'd like to see, like you said, St. Bernadine's throw the ball around a little bit. Here they go, trying to move around. Look like they got a bit of space in the way. as well. Look at the speed. Will anyone catch her? Well, Ten to go, on. five to go. The wing is pulled back up. up. She looked beat at the start, but she's done really well to catch back up. What a mistake at half. Ref says play on. Got away with that one. Didn't she look a smooth runner there, Jordan? She is. She goes again. Still going. Oh, comes off the left foot too, and then back off the right. Good defence there. Uh, Cleveland's line defence is quite strong when they get set. Here they go. They cover their space well. The only thing I'd say with St. Bernardine's, I'd like to see their far middle link and winger just spread out a little bit. They're in the centre of the field. Last touch here, I believe. Oh, sorry. St. Bernardine's actually in the maroon and blue here and, and Cleveland in the black and yellow. So, apologies for that. Cleveland predominantly normally in, in maroon, so that's why I've got that one wrong. But... St. Bernardine's now get a chance to ruck off the line. They've done a really good job to hold St. Uh, Cleveland out there. And they spread the ball a little bit here. She finds some space down the sideline. St. Bernardine's. We see them get the first try of this game just a little in and away down the sideline you see her run run the distance it's a good run there from St. Bernardine's winger not sure who that is at this stage but we'll get that name to you shortly a really good try to start this game Cleveland now tapping off from halfway to get us back underway nice and straight through their rucking Here's our speedster from a little bit earlier. And just a really good touch there from the middle from St. Bernardine's. We don't have all the numbers here for you, so we'll just call them when we can. But good hands there. Just drops that one. So St. Bernardine's now rucking off their line. She finds a little bit of space, but a great touch there from Cleveland. If she doesn't make that, there might be another try on the board for St. Bernardine's. Doing a great, great job through the rucking at the moment. It's going nice and straight. Just go over the mark. So Cleveland's going to get a chance on the try line. If they can get down there. Let her get away with that one, just stood out a couple of times, but we'll play the touch. Like to see Cleveland just spread out a little bit here. Great touch there from the link of St. Bernardine's. Off 
the left foot. Another great touch. It's last touch here. Let's see what Cleveland can come up with. They do have some numbers out on this side if they can find it. Ooh. Nearly slices through number 20 there from Cleveland. Runs onto the ball here. Finds a little bit of space. Once again, well defended from Cleveland in the link. She's finding it. A little bit of space. Just quite, not quite getting there at the moment. Comes off the left foot. Great cover defense, great shutdown defense from Cheveland there. Cheering you here in the background is from field two as we see McGregor go over. And we've just got a ball down there, so Cleveland rucking off their line now. We did make a mistake before Jazzy Cleveland are actually in the black and yellow. My apologies. Just used to Cleveland being maroon and white, mate. So it is an high school level, you're correct. Oh, we found some space. In and away. I think she's gonna get there. Is that a touch? Great, great diving touch. A great run from Cleveland there, but even better diving touch from number 33 from St. Bernardines. She, oh, it just slipped over. There was a half gap there. Lee Ellen, I think that was who made that touch, Jazzy. So we're going to let her roll the ball again. Few girls with hands on hips, the humidity and the heat just getting to us here. Towards yeah, the back end of day one. Out there. No half, defenders up. Yeah, ref's communicating well with the players there. We said no half, so she let, she let the defenders move forward. They managed to kill that play. Makes them take it back to the mark. Also, ref's doing a really good job out there. And like you said, it is very humid, so these refs doing a great job in the heat as well. Young Laney refing out there, he's the most experienced ref, former student of the Runcorn High Touch Academy. Good for him to come back, give back to the school and the program and the culture that we have here. So great to see yeah, It's a great one to start and obviously some really talented players coming through uh, the Runcorn system over the last 10 years. So notable players in, in obviously Cody Green, Willie, William Briston, uh, played at a very Jesse high Green level. Well. Jesse Green there as well, yeah. come back and do a little bit of work with the school as well so to have that caliber of player coming back and giving back to the school is always a good thing to get the development in our youth system so here they go just off the mark stop and go shooter gets them so i think the shooting defense we look for that extra pass here we'll make an extra five or ten meters there's the one defender up again Cleveland there. Don't know, is there a bit of face paint here? Is it Jazzy or? I can't quite see from here. My old eyes are deceiving me, but you might be correct, Jordan. Where can I get my face painted? Is that is that happening here or? I think that might be a, a school thing, mate. Just school thing? School spirit. Maybe I'll have to go, go around and see Cleveland later to get my face painted, but. Well, what colours go nice with red, mate? It will, won't it? Nice and bright out there. And like I said before, it's good to see these girls having a lot of fun out here in such a beautiful day. Nice little breeze. Tight battle, it's still a 1-0. 15 minutes to go. Anyone's game here, it's take a moment of brilliance and we can open this game up. Yeah, and we've seen Cleveland a couple of times get some space down the sideline and St. Bernardine's just doing a really good job in their uh, cover defense. They're just hanging around, aren't they? Just doing enough. Extra efforts to stop tries are staying in the game. Definitely anyone's game at this stage. Cleveland looking extra pass. No half. There we go, rucking again, going forward. Holds the ball in two hands, make sure it's danger. Probably just need to spread out a little bit. We can see the uh, the St. Bernardine's defense just staying nice and wide, not letting them get around, but we go a right foot step and a dummy. And good defense there. 
Go forward again, two hands again. We've got last touch, let's see what they can come up with here. See if they can use the ball and spread it. Off the right foot, tries to get on the outside, but St. Bernardine's up to the task there. So we see them start rucking off their line. First drive, great touch there. There's a few of them in St. Bernardine's, Jazzy, that just head down, straight forward, as hard as they can. It's really good to see. But we've just gotten over the mark, unfortunately, there. Yeah, so over the mark, so just when you get towards the defender, it's really a good idea to just slow down, take some shorter steps, so we just don't take that extra step and get a turnover after a great run. So Cleveland get a really good opportunity here to level the scores up. Right foot step. Winger for St. Bernardines doing a really good job at the moment. Oh. Probably wasn't ready for that one to come back to her, but the option was there. Once again, St. Bernardines just hanging around, doing enough to stop the tries. They're close enough if good enough, and she looks likely number four. Yeah, up 1-0, that's what you want to do. You want to defend your line. You can win a game 1-0, so if they can uh, hold the tries out, then we'll be good. it up again like you said your most experienced ref picks up the touch and pass there really good job there don't get away with those with Wayne refereeing gotta watch for that it's one of his favourite calls as a referee off the mark he shows it there again Cleveland that looked dangerous can they execute one here just trying to get on the outside of that winger and she's been defending that really well the whole game. A bit of panic. There's still 30 minutes to go. Cleveland can still just try to get down the other end and build pressure. Yeah, long time. Everything seems to be coming down this end at the moment. I'd like to see them try and go the other side and see if they can create some space down that way. But St. Bernardine's with a great, great ball there. Long pass. Get on the outside. And again, good hands. Gets on the outside. Is she over? Down she goes. She's got the speed. Cover defence. Oh, I think oh, she's... Did she get that down? It's hard to see from here, line. but refs calling ball down. Ball down, yeah. Well, what a great run that, that was. was. Great run. And I'd say the cover defence just put that extra little bit of pressure on. It forces a drop ball there, so... Cleveland coming off the line. What have they got? Can they get away? Down the sideline. Great first ruck. And like we said before, just hanging in there. That was a... Uh, Good opportunity for St. Bernardines to go up two touchdowns to nil, but Cleveland holding on. And if this winger can stay nice and wide, could Either create way, some space. Two and one. And this winger again, Jordan, you picked it early. She has not been beaten for the last 10 minutes. She's had two and ones numerous occasions, and she's got great hit position. Oh, oh gets oh, beaten that time. Commentator's curse. But covers, covers, covers it back. well, though. The key for her is we see her stay nice and wide on the outside of her, uh, her attacking player. So she defends nice and wide so that if they try and run around, she's already got it covered. So she's doing uh, a really good job. I mentioned earlier about her hip position. So she's got her hips facing the sideline. So if she does get beaten on her outside, her hips are facing in a position she can sprint and chase straight away. Yeah. And that's helped her stop some potential tries. Last play, looking for some extra passes. And it's another one of those things at these young ages, it's uh, hard to teach. Uh, really early is how to get your body position into the right position so uh, they're obviously doing a really good job at St. Bernardine's at the moment going forward Cleveland need to try to get a stop here around halfway I'd like to see them try to press there's a bit of an overlap here oh, left foot and again stop left and foot go again. she's and got she space all the way. will she go she's all the in. way and she has oh, no. oh, let's have a look at that replay bang left, left foot, bang left foot again. And then look, the head down here. Just takes off. Straightens up as well. And that could be the match winner. In a tight battle, takes that one moment of brilliance. Halfway, left, bang, bang, whack city. The thing and I like over. to see, mate, is Cleveland grabs the ball, runs straight back to halfway, ready to go again. So they know that they probably need to score soon in a tight game, like you said. But that was pretty to watch. Still 10 minutes to go. They're still in the game. Here they go, going forward. Showed a real turn of, turn of foot as well, like, oh. Good footwork there. Now on the try line. Try and 
Try to bring him out. Oh, she might have it. Stop and go. Straighten up. There you oh, go. Oh, fantastic play. The stop and go. Here so we she go. She just holds it up. And she's beaten two defenders there, Jordan. Stop. No, she had about 20 metres of space out there. Made eye contact, slowed down, made them all stop, wait on their heels, and bang, took them on the sideline. Great to see line. That's what you want if you're Cleveland, isn't it? You, you let one in. Reminds me of a young Stevie Loudon, mate, the stop and go, high quality performance. Mate, I saw that on the wrong end of it too many times. <laughs> that was uh, a good play to watch. Not quite square. Oh, the ref picked pick that up. up. Great call. So Sorry. Cleveland, change of momentum. They've scored one turnover first touch. Let's, Let's see, see if that gives them a little bit of confidence. Uh, great first defensive touch there by St. Bernardine. Tough side here. They don't give you much. Yeah, 19. I think that's Kaylee. She's done a really good job. Oh, she's thought she had some space again. Kaylee's done a really good job defensively so far in this game. We've got a ball down. St. Bernardine's straight onto it. Coach takes a big sigh of relief there, Jordan. Yeah, those ones hurt, don't they? I've probably done that a few times to you over the years. Yeah, Jordan, I've coached you a few times, and that's why I'm bored and grey, mate. I'm just uh, trying to get you to run the policies, yeah. usually, defensively more than anything. But you're young, mate. You'll get better. Yeah, I'll, I'll get there, <laughs> mate. Get there. Got to listen to your coaches. <laughs> Big shout-out to all the coaches here. Give it up their weekends to coach these teams to give these young players an opportunity during these COVID times to better play a bit of sport and have a bit of fun. Yeah, it's good to see some spectators out here. Obviously, the family's coming out to watch their kids play as well. And uh, in these times, probably didn't know when we were going to get that again. So, Turnover there. Cleveland coming off their line. St. Bernardines have got them where they want them. Eight minutes to go. Some big gaps through the defence at the moment if they can find some space. Here's our girl who ran around it before. She goes. Just going forward there. Great metre. 20 metre ruck. St. Bernadette's just wait on their heels a bit, not moving forward now. I think, like you said before, she made some really good metres, but I'd like to see... Oh, off the left foot. Good touch. I'd like to see her put her hand out and just go forward once she's beaten one. Extra pass. Need a half. New players coming on. Can they give us some energy here? Extra pass again. Bit of a switch. Great defence. Number 19 has been a dominant defensive player ever seen. Yeah, I think there's been the two of them. The winger, uh, who, who's off at the moment, and uh, number 19. have done a really good job defensively to keep St. Bernardese in this lead. And we've got six touch there. So St. Bernardine's get a chance to ruck off their line. She just takes her time, takes it out to the seven metre line, trots nice and forward. Find some space around her. Great touch from St. Bernardine's winger there. Good defence. Shooting up. Takes two touches. As we see, find some space. It's down the sideline. Oh, she's made the touch though. Really good touch back there. Not sure of the number, but we saw Cleveland in back play. Just cover defence again. And we've got a penalty for offside here for Cleveland. So just over five minutes in this game, about six minutes to go. Cleveland don't want to concede a try here. So just take it nice and slow. Oh, ball down. That's exactly what Cleveland needs. So we'll see them if they can go coast to coast here. They get straight onto the ball. Just take it back to the mark there. Nice and straight. Really good job from Cleveland. We see them go for a sub just there. We've got subs coming on, go straight again. Can they create some space? 
34 for St. Bernardine's as Emily McIntyre has done a really good job defensively out on that wing. So once again, oh, we just got ball down there. Probably had the space through the middle with a little draw and pass, but Cleveland get another opportunity with five minutes to go to level this game up. Taking your time there. Let's see if they create some space. Pass just goes to ground there, so still not out of this game, Cleveland, but need to get a couple of stops in the next couple of minutes. Probably can't let St. Bernardine score anytime soon, so. They shift it out to the wing. Down the sideline she goes. She might be in here. Cover defense from Cleveland. A great try there from St. Bernardine's winger. Extends the lead to three touchdowns to one. Might just be the one that finishes this game off. Cleveland definitely need to probably hit back here if they can. He's our try scorer for Cleveland. Takes the ball forward. Great shooting defense from St. Bernardines. Off the left foot. Nothing happening there. Just takes it back to the mark, rolls it again. Can they create some space down this side? Good touch there from number four once again. Sorry, 19. It's going to be last touch. Let's see if Cleveland can come up with anything. And well defended from St. Bernardine's. Gonna be a tough ass now. Number four just goes nice and straight. Another try here probably puts this game to bed. Still two minutes to go. It's definitely not out of the question, but tough ass here for Cleveland. Bernadine's trying to find some space. Wingers trying to chase her. Really good touch. That's going to be last touch now. They go through the hands. Ball's gone. They chase again. We found some space. And great touch there from Cleveland winger. They will have to score this set if they want any chance of drawing this game, but a minute 40 to go. It's probably over by now, but let's see if they can get another one late. Comes off the right foot, left foot. Really good defense there again from number 19. And just ball to ground. So half passes off there. Great touch there from Cleveland. Little in and away. Find some space. Good cover defense once again. Find some space. We've got a ball was down first, so that's a try there. With only about 20 seconds to go. 
St. Bernardines extend the lead to four touchdowns to one. That might be the last play of the game here. And there's the hooter. So St. Bernardines just too good here, winning four touchdowns to one over Cleveland. We'll take another short break here. We'll be back with the next round of games shortly.